today for the Bitcoin price and yes crazy news are breaking about Bitcoin right now and this video is a huge actually my last warning to all Bitcoin bears out there I want to pull up some news some information which might change your opinion on Bitcoin forever watch this video until the very end guys because if you are bearish on Bitcoin right now if you are considering selling your Bitcoin right now you might be making one of the biggest mistakes of your life. Let's talk about that. Let's go straight into the content. And if you like these videos, no matter where I am, no matter when I am, I am about to uh, actually travel right now. Please smash up the like button to a new all-time high. I would truly appreciate that, guys, uh, because especially these shorter videos, they are not carried out by YouTube as much as they deserve it. So please like, share, and comment down below. Now let's talk about the Bitcoin price and let's talk why I am right now today more bullish than ever and i know i posted this like when bitcoin was at 35,000 us dollars i posted this youtube video bitcoin i'm going all in right now people were laughing some people were spitting of course but in the end of the day i was standing my ground with my bullishness and i had a very good reason for that i want to elaborate a little bit on that and i want to tell you why 2022 might be a year much more bullish than everyone expects and I want to start with the conflict we are having right now between Ukraine and Russia. I don't like war. I think it's terrible, right? I am against governments. We have to understand, and this is just one quick story before I'm starting with the actual bullish news on Bitcoin. We have to understand that it's governments, actually, not countries, not people. It's governments making this war. And I can see some people already being like, uh, I, in Germany, there are restaurants. They don't like let Russian people in. I think it's ludicrous. The Russian people don't even want that. You have to look at the governments. That's the one thing I wanted to say. It's very unfortunate. I hope this is over as soon as possible. With that being said, of course, for Bitcoin, this environment is extremely bullish. We had this Black Thursday dump, just like in 2020, February, we had the Black Thursday. And I told you a few days ago, this is once again a Black Thursday. It looks bearish, but it's bullish. It's the same thing again. And I want to talk about why I think this year Bitcoin might be going to hundreds of thousands of US dollars per Bitcoin. I have very good reasons for that and I will explain it economically. Going here into that, we just had 14 hours ago CNBC reporting Bitcoin jumps 10% after Treasury imposes new sanctions against Russia's central bank. So what are we having we are having of course a need for something like Bitcoin on the Russian side. We are having let me go back we are having a need of Bitcoin on the side of Ukraine because, of course, people need donations. What sh how should you do donations if, um, of course, the banking system is failing right now, people can't pull out money out of the bank account? Bitcoin is the answer, right? Russia, Ukraine, both need Bitcoin. We are looking at Argentina, Brazil, Turkey, wherever you have high inflationary environment. They need Bitcoin, right? I mean, the ruble just lost like 60, let me quickly go over here, 60% of its value recently? I mean, come on. The ruble denominated Bitcoin volume surges to a nine month high? I, it, it can't get more obvious. Bitcoin shirt surges 9.3% over demand from Russians and Ukrainians. So please do keep in mind, Bitcoin is the answer for high inflationary environments, for environments where, um, like in Canada, where they are closing bank accounts. Right now, it's more relevant than ever. And 2022 will more than ever show us that Bitcoin is the answer. This is why I do not care about short-term dumps, not even long-term, mid-term. Bitcoin is probably going to rise drastically. Think about that. 2% of the world's population is exposed to Bitcoin. 98% is not exposed to Bitcoin, meaning 98% of the world is short on Bitcoin right now. Keep this in mind. And now, dear ladies and gentlemen, we are having 7,000 billionaires and billion dollar institutions in the world. I think now it's 8,000. Of them, 200 are exposed to Bitcoin. That's 3% of the billionaires. Then we are having 40 million millionaires in the world, from which few percent are only exposed to Bitcoin. Do you understand the sheer potential? And if the demand of Bitcoin increases, the supply is not increasing, it's hard coded in the blockchain. Let's say the demand for, for gold increases, right? Of course, 
more money pours into gold mining, more money pours into research and development of gold mining, and of course it gets more efficient, more gold is being mined, the total supply is uncertain. If more money turn, goes into Bitcoin mining, the only thing which happens is the network gets more secure. We are still having the same inflation rate, right? This is something we have to keep in mind. The global economic and political uncertainty right now is fuel for the Bitcoin price. This is why I dedicated my life to talk about this. This is why I was more bullish than ever throughout the last few days to show you my stance. Why exactly right now it might be the worst mistake to be selling Bitcoin or financial advice. Let me know what you think about that. And I think this year it is very possible that we are going to reach 100, 200, 300,000 US dollars as price target for Bitcoin. Let me know what you think about that. But looking into the economic landscape, these news are speaking a very clear language and it just continues. Think about Venezuela, think about Argentina, think about the Turkish Lira in Turkey. It's not getting better, guys. When governments having an incentive structure as they are having it right now, they are not, never going to stop printing. Governments are not going to stop with their wars. They are not going to stop printing. So please keep this in mind. Bitcoin is your safe haven. If you are selling Bitcoin right now, just because you think it might be going down to 25 or something, you are running the danger to be standing on the sidelines forever. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I truly hope you appreciate this video, which is a little bit different than usually. I truly appreciate you. That is for certain. Thank you so much for your likes. Thank you so much for your love. Peace and love to every single one of you, no matter where you're coming from. I truly love you. We are going to see each other very soon at the next one of LM Crypto. And I am going to be departing right now. We are going to see each other very soon at the next one of LM Crypto. And as always, guys, as always, bye-bye.